So, you think you can survive in Iran without watching this video? Funny. Hello everyone! What's up? Welcome to our channel. I'm Hasti and in today's video, I'm gonna tell you 10 things that you must not do in Iran. Why? Because it's going to have consequences and they're bad. So stay with me and let's go. Hold on a second. Let me tell you. Number 10, it's so important. It's about our lovely currency and uh, I bet you don't want to miss it. So uh, stay till the end and now let's go. What is the most important thing in the world? Exactly, money. <laughs> so, when you travel to Iran, don't forget to forget your credit card. <laughs> Joking aside, guys. Number one, don't forget to bring cash. You're not going to travel to Iran expecting that you can buy things with your credit card or debit card and this kind of thing, right? I mean, Iran has been under international sanctions for so many years forever maybe and we are not connected to international banks too so it's not gonna work out and another thing there are different exchange rates in Iran the best exchange rate is government rate and also be careful to exchange your money at authorized offices nowhere else okay number two don't forget Iran dress codes as you know Iran is a Islamic country, so we are Muslims, right? For women, you should be something like this. <laughs> we call it hijab or hijab, or something like that. You have to cover your body and put something on your hairs, you know? Uh, something to cover your hairs, but it's not like Iran is so strict about hijab. Uh, don't bother yourself a lot. And about men you're not allowed to wear shorts no way actually you can wear t-shirt shirts and all this stuff but you have to wear pants and yeah sorry but remember women suffer more so be thankful number three don't touch the opposite sex guys we are muslims i told you and muslims don't touch the opposite sex. Well, actually, I have seen some Muslims do in movies, but not in Iran. So, you cannot shake hands, hug, I don't know, put your hand over them when you want to take picture and all this stuff. And kissing? Are you kidding me? Exchange greetings, but keep your hands next to your body. That's it. Number four. Don't show public display of affection. Seriously, guys, you don't want to show it in public, right? If you're traveling as a couple and you're looking for a romantic vacation, well, why Iran? <laughs> Forget it because people is going to call you rude and shameless, even if you're married. P.S. You can take each other hands. Just this, but kissing and hugging and all those stuff, no, 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 no. No showing display of affection in public. Let's Number five, don't look for alcohol in Iran. We're Muslim, okay, and we don't drink alcohol. And in Iran, it's something like we don't drink alcohol, so nobody can do. Anyway, alcohol is forbidden in Iran, and by alcohol, I mean alcoholic drinks, you know? So don't look for it and don't try to bring it into country. That's it. Number six, don't talk. Politics. It's not like we Iranians have a big right of speech in here. So we ourselves try not to talk politics so much because, well, there's going to be consequences, bad ones. I offer you not to talk about politics and our politicians, especially the leader. Number Seven, don't take photos of governmental buildings. This one is so serious and I bet you don't want to break it, guys. Because you don't want to end up at prison, right? Near governmental buildings, military sites, and any place with no photography sign, please keep your camera out of sight unless you're a spy. Are you? 
No. Come on, where, where are you going? Hey, hey. <laughs> where are you going? Number eight. Don't blow your nose in public. Actually, I was shocked after I realized it's something normal in other countries. Really? I can believe it, guys. In Iran, we do our best to make the lowest sound out of ourselves. You know, even when we want to sneeze, we do it in the way that it sounds on it like. And in some countries, people blow their nose in public and. Uh, Anyway, don't blow your nose in public in Iran. People will call you rude and disgusting. Number nine. Don't ever say Arabian Gulf or the Gulf. First of all, I'm not nationalist at all. But this subject is so touchy to every single of Iranians. Guys, this is forever Persian Gulf. If you can't say it or if you think it's not true, then don't come to my country. That's it. Forever Persian Gulf. And the last one, number 10. Don't talk about Riyal in Iran. If you're traveling to Iran, you may heard that Iran's currency is Riyal. But seriously, we don't use it at all. Well, actually, we use it in offices and those stuff, you know? We use Toman. And what's the difference between Toman and Rial? Well, Toman has one less zero. For example, if we have 10 Rials, then we have one Toman. And that's it. But our lovely currency is a little bit more confusing than this. So I'm thinking about making a whole video just discussing about our currency. If you want me to do that, let me know in the comment section, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video guys. I hope you liked it. If you did, please be sure to give the thumbs up, click that subscribe button and leave me a comment. Tell me what you think. Actually, there are a lot of things that you must not do in Iran. Uh, these were only a few. If you want me to make another video about it and tell you the other things, let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much. Love you all. See you later. Bye.